All right, greetings and salutations. My name is Comic Fire, and welcome back for more Shin Megami Tensei Digital Devil Saga. In the last episode, we made significantly more progress than in episode 5. And in this episode, we're going to continue making that progress. And fighting enemies. But thankfully... Bafula! Real simple. I want to be careful. I don't want to fall for my untimely poison gassing. Like a kaja don't mean anything to me, because boom, boom, and then earth. I should have put you down the, uh... Nah, no! Oh, you almost got me, you crafty bastard. Charged in blind. Oh, now I've got an adrenaline rush going. It's kind of like a like I worked at a Panera, and I remember the first day I trained on salads. I'll tell you how sheltered I am because I got a friggin' adrenaline rush from making a salad. I'm like, yeah, I did something right, and then oh, this is the greatest thing. <laughs> Great, loved it. Still love it. It's a great job. And Jasper. Hey, it's cursed. See? Seven damage back. Now there are skills dedicated to putting curses on people, but I'm really not. I said I wasn't into that percentile damage based stuff, and I'm not into instant kills. There are very few games where they're actually worthwhile, and this isn't one of them. Strange Journey, I'll spam uh, good old Mamuto on every day, or all day every day, but here? No, it's just... it's not my dig. Alright, I'm not going to be able to make it from this angle, so let's start from the other angle. Got a brave ration out of it, though. This is just like a... If a regular ration's like a casting of Dia, a brave ration's like a Diorama. Really should start putting, putting, putting surf, putting surf into a uh, more vitality. Being a magic nuke is good and all, but. What's it gonna do you if you can't live? Alright, not that way. At least the game is pretty good at telling you which way you're not gonna be able to go. And that's the one we fell into before. Cool. I'm like bookends. Started from the bottom and now we're here. Just get everyone to transform since Sucky by apparently just loved to toss out Atma and EXP. Atma and Karma, as it were. Alright, let's see. What do you got? Spell Repel? That's cool. He doesn't learn it yet. Makakaja? That's cool. It's not like you're gonna be alive to use it. Oh, crap. Eat, you failed me! Alright, didn't charm anyone. Charm is a really nasty status effect. It'll just turn you against the party. It's like confusion, except, uh... Actually, confusion's kind of weird in this game, so it's not like standard JRPG confusion. Watch out for that woman. She will repel you. What do you mean? There's a lot of women... Not a lot of them repelled me. <laughs> sure, everyone can identify. Unless you're not into women. I guess it goes for the same for guys repelling you. I don't know. Someone's on the other side of the door. It's a good thing I saved. Oh, hey, a woman. Ooh, a 
Valkyrie. I'm going to assume by Repel this isn't going to work too well. Except that works friggin' wonderfully, so I don't know what you're talking about. Get another boo feeling going then. Yeah, she's almost dead. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm not going to take Repel too seriously. Like, she's just going to... You know, repel you, like in Monster Hunter, where you know if a monster runs away, it's because you've repelled them. Either way, didn't happen. We get the left statue key. Nice. Now I can turn back and go back to those statues over there. Gonna be a slight of a walk, but hey, it's a JRPG. Should be used to walking and backtracking and level grinding, huh? Oh, it's part of the fun. Blue eyes, white dragon. Kind of wanted LP a Yu-Gi-Oh game once, but I don't know. How do you LP one of those? I guess you'd have to, like, really be into Yu-Gi-Oh, and now I... When was the last time I even looked at Yu-Gi-Oh? I don't watch Yu-Gi-Oh abridged, which is weird, because I love uh, Dragon Ball Z abridged so much. Oh, damn it. Please don't attack our... Oh, no. Fuck! No! Don't kill him, don't kill him, don't kill him! Alright, thank you. You got it. All right. Got a lot of revival gems. Are Jilla back into the fray? Oh damn. Okay, this worked wonderfully. Shouldn't I just throw in a discharge? Ah, damn you! Discharm on me? I don't need a Discharm, I have a Panacea, because Discharms don't actually exist. I don't want to take any chances. Wow. a good message about thinking with the right head, let me tell ya. Thankfully, I was not muted. A muted magic nuke is kinda like, uh, magic nuke that can't cast magic. That's exactly what it is. Oh, jeez, speaking of criticals. Mm -hmm. Alright, Argilla, what are you gonna get? It's a good level. I mean, you got it in only one thing that you ever want. Actually, she benefits from everything, I guess. There, I, guess I guess there isn't one stat that Argilla, like, Straight up doesn't one. She can. Everyone can always use a little strength just to make a holding down triangle to make random battles go quicker. Vitality is always good and magic is always great unless you're heat. Agility, to my knowledge, it prevents ambushes, which means I really should be putting a lot more uh, into agility than I am. Now, huh? And surface can puzzle. Oh shit. Surface still can puzzle. Can I get a Pafula going? 
Or re reverting. That's exactly what I meant, sir. Proud of you, man! Forgot I have Medea. That's beautiful. No, thankfully. Okay, bye. Not to say there wasn't much harm he could do just sitting there all dumbfounded, but... I guess there's an equally less amount of harm he could do here. At least here he could pop one into a... Uh, one of the characters. And yet Surf still got most of that. Is he still out? Oh yeah, he's still out. Wow. That could have been bad. Walk into another battle with some dangerous enemies without Surf. Be a... Be a foolish ploy. I'm not about foolish ploys here in the comic empire. Alright, so straight back down, and we're about to finish up the dungeon. Because unlike the second game... Insert the R statue key. Oh no. Damn it. How far back is this? Oh, we're actually like right there, that's cool. That could have been worse, I guess. I don't know, there's a lot I can say about the second game, and I'm still not entirely sure I'm going to LP it. There's a lot I can say and very little of it's good, I should be saying. But my main complaint is that the dungeons drag way too long. And this game's dungeons know exactly when to stop. I never really get sick of any of the dungeons here, and if there was a dungeon I could get sick of, it stopped. I don't really get sick of it. I, I need to get. I need to stop with these damn ambushes. Uh, yeah. Oh, there's a critical and a mute. You don't just hop back for mutes either. Can I retreat, please? Yes, thank you. Thankfully, I know I've got a dismute somewhere in here. Alright, so we turned it to the left, and boy howdy, we didn't like that. Nice. Now, do we want to switch them both to the left, or do we want to go opposite of that? No, let's go for the opposite. Newcomer trick. We've got really good nasal passages then, Heat. Yeah, now we can stop breathing in that toxic gas. Probably wasn't good for our complexion. And I colored, and I colored till my colors were all gone. I know this is gonna come out of left field, but when have I ever not come out of left field? You know what I really like about Easter time? It's jelly beans. Jelly beans are like my favorite candy ever. And I'm not talking about like the Jelly Belly ones. I don't know, I can't stand Jelly Bellies. But it's the Brocks or Bratches or whatever it's called. It's B R A C H if you're. I assume it's a U.S. brand. Just love those to death. I mean, some sometimes you get a bag that tastes like you know soap, but my 
fucking love those jelly beans. And I can only seem to find them around Easter, at least around here. Jelly bellies are just way too sweet for me. I'm not a... I don't know if anyone knows this about me, but I'm not a big fan of sweets. Boss time. Yeah. 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 Uh, we're gonna be casting health for us, and our Jill is going on full Medea duty. Ura. He can't do anything. One Medea on the rocks. There, yeah, half of the Yakuza's are down. He's the only one taking any sort of- ah, fuck. Double damn, wow. guy is a nightmare and a half. Oh, fuck. And it's that damn death spray, because he can get land a curse on us. Not that I really care about anyone else, I just want Turdok out of the way. His name sounds like Turd. Cool, he's out of the way. Wait till he becomes a standard random encounter. Is this what a rave is like? Everyone just gets mad and turns into a demon? Cool. Wait, he surfs back to his standard itself. Not doing much as his standard self, but hey, he's here. Yeah, he's not really screamy when he's just a human. We're required to obey our leaders by law. How could he betray her? I'm not surprised. Following an incompetent leader tends to get you killed pretty damn fast. Kate! So what now? You want to run away like sissies? Sir, we can't leave Janana. Let's rescue her. Okay. 
throne room! Why didn't we get a kick-ass throne room? Oh well, budget cuts hit all the tribes hard, I guess. Oh yay, enemies. Oh hey, these guys are just random encounters now. Cool! I love fighting guys with two press turn icons. Oh wait, he's dead. Hopefully I can find another karma terminal so I can, uh... I'm probably not gonna get agile out by the time I fight the next boss, but... Still, you know how I feel about wasting experience. I'm not digging this. Okay, I'm just running away then. So all this is gonna do is, as he eloquently said, get me killed pretty damn fast. Oh, never mind, here I am. I'm just buff again? That's cool. You can buff all you want just as long as you're not attacking me. So I have to get out of here one of these days. One I come down. Starting to get pretty high up. These guys seem more into buffing than attacking. That's cool, I guess. But you know what they say: the more, the merrier. It's kind of creepy, Mick. Maybe you just have something like this lying around. I can't make this a bit of a longer episode. More of a pain to edit, yes, but it's a labor of love. Uh, I don't have much to sell. At least not yet. I don't need Maka right now, so... I'm just running away from you guys. If you want to kill me? I'd advise you. I'd advise against you. Then I'm just gonna be in a different place, and you're not gonna be able to touch me. Is it cowardly? Yes. You call it cowardly. I call it a survival tactic. Yeah. I'm all saved up. Did you really expect to beat me on an empty stomach? Janana! Are you... No way! That stupid woman never devoured anyone! Same as you. I won't kill needless. Janana. Get away from me. No, 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 no. 
an honor. <laughs> so, she's turned all demon now, eh? <gasps> Seems like anyone who has the power ends up like that sooner or later. It started happening to some of my men, but they sure tasted good going down. Serves them right for trying to gang up on me. Have fun devouring each other. And I'm gonna go snack on whatever soldiers that stupid bitch still has left. <laughs> Damn it! Don't show her any mercy! Yeah.